Well, that wasn't smart. Good morning, everybody. It is 4.44 a.m. And we are back at it again. So there's a spot I want to check out that I saw somebody catching uh, fish out of yesterday. They said they had caught four fish in an hour swinging flies. So that's where we're going. Let's go check it out. So there's a spot I saw yesterday when we were drifting down. And I apologize for the noise because I'm literally <laughs> parked on the highway here. Um, but we saw a spot yesterday when we were drifting and I talked to somebody about um, where they were fishing and I saw that they were up above the road so I saw where they parked and I marked it on my map so that's what I'm trying to find right now and to be honest with you I really don't like parking along the highway trying to find something but everything that I'm seeing here along the highway here I don't see I mean I see garbage which unfortunately tells me you know that there's people that have walked through this but I'm not really seeing any way to get down here yet um, so I mean this might be this might be a complete bust but I figured I would at least try it and uh, and see if this is something that's even possible so yeah I don't know I mean I don't see any trails to get down there so I'll check in with you guys here in a little bit and let you know if uh, this is something that I was able to get to. I found a trail. Um, let's venture through this. Well, that wasn't smart. That could have been really bad. Yeah, I'm gonna call this. Ah, let's get out of here. Ah. I'm okay, I did fall down face first, but luckily I didn't hit anything. Steady, Paul. All right, well, 
We'll have to figure something out here. Now that the light's out a little bit more, this is what, what we're working with here. This is what I fell down, not this particular area. You'll see when we get through here. I'm almost there. Um, but that's where all the fish are, right there. All right, so now that it's a little bit lighter out, you guys can kind of see what it is I'm, I'm working through here. Try not to fall down this like I did last time, like right there. I don't know if people ask, is it worth going through all this to, to catch some fish? You know, because once I get to the other side of this, I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get over. So, I mean, this whole thing's a complete gamble. And again, I don't know how deep that is right there. So again, now that it's light, I'll try this again. Just try to be a little bit more careful this time going around. Now this is the, the sketchy part right here and I don't see a path through there. So that's not very promising to me. So let's, uh, let's go through this. Good start this time. Yeah, guys, I think that's just way too thick. I don't really have a good... Nope. So close. stand down here that's a good sign yeah guys I don't know how deep that is there it's I'm not gonna risk falling in there and not being able to get out All right, everybody, I'm back in the car. Uh, I am disappointed that I wasn't able to find uh, a trail to get down to that piece of water. And I even said going down that trail because I thought I was going to be able to get through the rest of it. I made the comment, um, you know, how far are you willing to go to catch a fish? Well, you know, yes, I'm willing to go to certain extents, but um, I am by myself today, solo trip. And you know, this is just my little safety PR. Um, you know, and I hesitate saying this because I know that, you know, there's times where I'll probably gung ho and do it too, but there's no fish worth, you know, risking your life over. Take, and I stress this, take calculated risks, but make sure they're calculated. Don't just go out willy nilly. And that's why I pulled back when I got to the end of those sticker bushes there. I didn't know how deep it was. Um, you know, and if you're with a buddy, you guys can maybe figure something out, a way to get through it safely or around it, or God forbid, if something happens to you, you can, um, you know, you got a buddy there to help you out or whatever it is. Hopefully it never comes to that. So yeah, be safe. I'm going to another spot and you know, again, that spot, if that's the only spot where I go, I can catch fish there. It's humbling, but it really reveals to me my, my lack of water reading skills. So that's all that is, is that <clears throat> we'll want to sit there and take that risk because we think that's the only piece of water right there that we can fish because I know there's fish there. Well, honestly, I don't, I don't know. I know there's fish there, but I don't know if they would, if they would take. So it's really important to learn to read the water so that you could go anywhere 
anywhere and piece together a piece of water there. So we'll move on. We'll go to the next spot and rainbows, sunshine, and smile faces all the way around. All right, so we're at a different location here. And this location that I'm at, um, it's possibly a location. Well, let's put it this way. You can see in the background, there's people there fishing off that point there. And I know there's humpies there because when we drifted down, I saw them there. But the thing I'm trying to see is I'm gonna try that spot I was trying to find earlier this morning. I'm gonna try to take this pathway, see how far it leads me up there and see if I can find a safe route in there. So if that's the case, then we can fish that spot I was trying to get to. If not, there's a couple spots that um, we can fish here. Like I said, it's gonna be an early morning. It's about 6.55 right now. I plan on being done by like nine, maybe 10. So we'll make it a great day. Stay tuned and I'll check in with you guys later. Where this trail leads to, this might lead us to where I was trying to get to this morning. Or this might just end right here, who knows. We've got this body of water here. If I can cross over somehow, then we're in business. <clears throat> Opens up a little bit more. like Gwen Safani walking through the spider webs here. All right, look at this. We can cross here. Again, I want to be very mindful. Put my glasses on just to play it safe. Oh, much better. Looks like we're in the clear. Cool, well we've crossed successfully. Maybe we can keep going up. That'd be good. If this is it, I'm trying to get up here. So it looks like this is the end of it. So I'm not gonna be able to walk up through there. I already went up through there. Well, gosh, so close again. Well, one last thing I can try. Quite the animal prints there. Don't know what they are. I see some human footprints, so they're going the other way. But um, this is going to be our last, last resort here. If nothing trails back into this way, then we'll just have to go to one other spot. All right, I'm definitely wanting to be mindful back here in this area. You know, because I'm kind of on the back side of where I want to go. I don't see any big footprints or anything. But, yeah. I guess we go around that bend. All right, gang, so I've just looked around the bend there and it looks like it wraps all the way around. Um, but again, I don't know if it's gonna go through to, uh, if I get to cut straight through all this, that's exactly where I'd wanna, that's exactly where I'm trying to get to. But um, gosh, yeah, I don't know how that kid got down there from what I saw, so. I guess it's just not meant for me to go to that spot. So we'll uh, venture back 
Maybe the walk back will seem quicker. Just like when you go on a trip, right? Trip always seems quicker on your way back home. So let's get out of this and uh, let's go fish. This is why we call, call it Spay Rod Adventures, right? <laughs> it's quite the adventure. Alrighty, well, <clears throat> I guess we're chalking today up to a uh, a scouting day. You know, the places I was going to go to on the river today, um, I knew that going to go check this one place out that I saw the person at yesterday when we were floating and I even saw his car up there. So I, I figured that it was going to be accessible. I took a gamble. I took a chance to check that out knowing that the other spots I was going to go to might have been full um, you know when I left that spot so the plan was to go to the spot that I had seen from the boat fish that try it out and I figured if nothing else not a big deal uh, you know at least I got to get my line wet so taking that chance though um, put me in the position to where the other spot that I was going to check out people were already there so wasn't able to get the line wet but I hope you guys enjoyed that little bit of uh, adventure of going through some of that stuff there. So I'll see you guys next time. I might be out on Monday. We'll do uh, an early episode then. But till then, stay safe out there. I'll see you guys out there. And if you see me out there, uh, say hi and uh, we'll uh, maybe go fishing together sometime. All right, bye.